welcome to Marseille, France. We're here for the launch of the new Kia Exceed. This new vehicle is the evolution within the Seed family for Kia. It is the fourth body type that we're bringing within the Seed range, and actually, it is a very unique one. When we developed this vehicle, we had very clear goals in mind. We wanted to give this vehicle its own distinctive styling, its own unique design, unique dimensions, but also unique packaging to cater the needs of the customers that are looking for emotional crossovers today. When we designed this vehicle, we took a very bold approach. We wanted to give the car a very distinctive styling, but at the same time, an emotional and coupe crossover body type. So we designed every single part of this vehicle with these principles in mind. Let's first have a look at the front of the car. The whole front of the car has been redesigned comparing it to the seat hatchback. We have now a much longer hood, which is also sitting much higher than the hatchback. We are six and a half centimeters higher, and this is giving the car a very aggressive and a very SUV look. Looking at some of the key design elements on the front of the vehicle, we have the most prominent, which is the new SUV grille with a dual blade sitting in parallel. This is also complemented by the chrome garnishes on the lower parts of the bumper and also on the middle part. These elements that are sitting in parallel are enhancing the way that the car looks wider and stronger on the street. Another very strong design signature in the front of the vehicle are the full LED headlamps. The full LED headlamps are standard across the exit range. They carry the ice cube design, which is part of the DNA of the seat family, but they also come with unique light guides that are floating from the middle to the sides of the car, enhancing again the front looks of the vehicle. As we said, we wanted to give a very emotional and coupe crossover look to this vehicle. One of the best ways to achieve that was from the design of the roofline. So we have introduced a very fast sloping roofline that goes around the vehicle down to the back, creating a, a thin C-pillar, which is a very sporty look to the vehicle. We also have a unique uh, window housing, this chrome window housing going around the windows, creating a unique design signature on the rear of the vehicle. Another important element when we talk about crossovers is the plastic cladding on the rear, on the lower part of the car. We have also introduced that it goes around the wheel arches, down to the side seal and to the back of the vehicle. This is important because it enhances the crossover look, but also the rigidity of the vehicle. A sporty and emotional vehicle without great wheels wouldn't exist. And therefore, we have introduced two unique designs just dedicated to this car. We have the 16-inch alloy wheels and we also have the 18-inch dual-tone diamond cut alloy wheels dedicated just for the new Kia Exceed. One of the best ways to look at this car is from behind. The car from behind looks very dynamic, emotional and sporty. This part of the emotion comes actually from the design and the different proportions we have in the rear. First of all, we have the upper part, which is a dark area created by the rear window. And this is contrasting to the wide and muscular body color part of the vehicle beneath it. This difference in proportions is creating this very dynamic look to the vehicle. Now let's look into the, some of the key details of the rear design. First of all, we have the introduction of the new sporty diffuser, which is sitting on the lower part of the bumper and features dual exhaust tips. We have the Exceed logo placed in the middle of the trunk door, creating a very symmetrical look to the vehicle. And we also have the introduction of the new full LED tail lights. We have a very unique design just for this vehicle with the light guides floating within the tail lights. This is giving a very clear signature when driving behind the vehicle. Looking at the interior of the new Kia Exceed, we can see that we carry the DNA and some of the key design elements of the rest of the Seed family. However, there are several new features that are coming new with the introduction of the Kia Exceed. First of all, we have the introduction of the 10.25 inch navigation screen that is sitting on the middle of the dashboard. And with the introduction of this new uh, panel, we have also redesigned the upper part of the dashboard within the cabin. Another introduction is the 12.3 inch Supervision Full Digital Cluster. This is a first time introduction for any model for Kia in Europe. As you can see, we can have up to three different applications open at the same time. So you can have your navigation, you can manage your music, or you can see the weather forecast all at the same time very easily. On top of that, we have the new function where you can connect up to two different Bluetooth devices at the same time. In this case, one device will be acting for the phone calls and the music and the other one could be managing only the music. This is very useful, especially when we have more people in the vehicle or we have the kids and nobody will distract the driver and his phone, but they can still manage the music in the vehicle. With the introduction of the new 10.25 inch navigation, we are also introducing 
the Kia telematic services, which we call the Uvo Connect. These are the connected car services by Kia. We can have a wide range of communication possibilities with the vehicle. We can receive information from the car, but we can also send information to the vehicle. In terms of receiving, we can first get our trip statistics, so we can see day by day what, how we have been driving, what is our average consumption, and many other information. We can receive diagnostic information from the vehicle, and we can also locate the vehicle, which is very useful, especially when we are more than one person uh, driving the vehicle. So for example, one person will park the car somewhere on the street and the other person will need to locate the vehicle. On top, we can also send information to the car. Very importantly, we can send our address to the vehicle, a destination address to the vehicle. So for example, when you are ready to go from home, you just send it through the application to the car. And when you arrive at the car, the navigation will simply ask you whether you want to navigate to that location. You can accept and you're easy to go. And very soon, we will be launching the remote services. The first service that will be coming in the coming months will be the remote door lock and unlock function. Very important is that all these services, all the connected car services and the future functionality upgrades are included for seven years without any additional charge for the customer. Kia connected car services for the first time within the seed range launching with the new Kia Exceed. With the introduction of this new car, we also wanted to give more options for customization and color selection to our customers. Therefore, we're introducing the new yellow color pack, which is dedicated just to the Kia Exceed. With the yellow color pack, we're bringing the new yellow color within the garnishes around the air vents, which is also contrasting with the overall dark dashboard of the Kia Exceed and the black headliner, which is dedicated just to this vehicle. On top, we're using different materials and stitching on the seats, so we have a unique color pack stitching just for the yellow color pack of the Kia Exceed. Moreover, we have stitches on the door panels and overall the color is appearing throughout the cabin, creating a very unique environment for the Kia Exceed. Our new compact coupe crossover is also scoring very well in terms of interior space. If we look at the trunk space available for the new Kia Exceed, we have 426 liters of trunk capacity. When we fold the seats down, this can go up to 1,378 liters of total space for carrying stuff in the vehicle, which is a very solid performance. But this also comes in a very versatile way. We have the introduction of the 40-20-40 rear seat folding, and we also have the dual layer floor, which makes it very easy and usable, the trunk space for the customers. With the key exit, as it is stated as a crossover, we wanted to achieve a very good performance in terms of the interior cabin space and the space that is available for all our customers. Therefore, we believe that we have achieved a very solid performance in terms of the legroom and the headroom that has been provided with the design of the new Kia Exceed. The vehicle behavior and the driving dynamics are very important when you talk about crossovers. And we put a lot of dedication into giving to this vehicle a comfortable ride, but at the same time, a sporty ride. Moreover, we have a wide range of engines that are coming with the Kia Exceed. We have in terms of petrol, the 1.0 turbo with 120 horsepower, 1.4 turbo, 140 horsepower, and we're also offering the 1.6 TGDI with 204 horsepower on the upper part of our engine lineup. We are also offering diesel selection with a 1.6 CRDI with low and high power, and we don't stop there. We will be soon coming into the market with the electrification of the Kia Exceed and eventually the seed range. So we are bringing soon the new plug-in hybrid 1.6 with a combined power 141 horsepower and very soon after, in early 2020, the mild hybrid on all our diesel engines. To sum up, we are very confident that we are bringing a very unique car into the C segment today. We are coming with a very distinctive, emotional and sporty design in a very coupe compact crossover packaging that enhances also the driving dynamics of the vehicle and also the interior space that we provide to the customers. Overall, we believe that we have found this sweet spot in the market today with this unique new vehicle. And I welcome you all to try and experience the new Kia Exceed. Thank you very much. Kia, the power to surprise.